Good chance the president is watching this interview or will watch this interview. What, what is your message to the president? Oh, message to the president. Um, I think that I would say that your message is excluding people. Um, you're excluding me. You're excluding people that look like me. You're excluding people of color. You're excluding, you know, Americans that, um, that maybe support you. Um, I think that we need to have um, a reckoning with um, the message that you have and what you're saying about make America great again. Um, I think that you're harking back to an era that was not great for everyone. It might have been great for a few people, and maybe America is great for a few people right now, but it's not great for enough Americans in this world. And I think that we have a responsibility, each and every one of us. You have an incredible responsibility as you know the chief of this country um, to take care of every single person, and you need to do better for everyone. The idea of make America great again, if it means going back to an America from the 40s or 50s, uh, that's an America where you could be imprisoned uh, for being gay, where you could be sent by your family to a, a mental hospital, where you could not walk down the street uh, holding hands with your loved one, or I could not walk down the street or go dancing or, or anything. It's, yeah. it's interesting how different people view things through a very personal lens um, and, and as you said, maybe don't walk in the shoes of other people who, you know, did not have rights in mm -hmm. a, a past halcyon America. Yeah, it, it was um, not a great place for a lot of people. It was a very oppressive place. Um, and that's not to say that it was the worst place in the world. Um, I think that's a, one of the things that um, a lot of people go to. No one's saying that they want to leave America. But I think as, as one of um, the great countries in the world and for, for sure we want to see ourselves as that. Um, we need to constantly look within and challenge ourselves to be better so everyone else can be better around us. Do you, uh, I know you've been invited by, I think, uh, Congresswoman Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, I think uh, Nancy Shout Pelosi. Out. Shout out. Shout out AOC. <laughs> so does that mean, is that an invitation you're taking up? Nancy Pelosi has said, you know, you're, uh, you'd be welcome to a bipartisan congressional thing. Um, do you plan on going to Washington in one one way or another? Yes, definitely. Um, and I think even just the conversations with the teammates that I've had, I think everyone is interested in going to Washington. I think we've always been interested in going to Washington. Um, this is such a special moment for us. Um, and to be able to, you know, sort of leverage this movement and talk about the things that we want to talk about and to celebrate like this with um, the leaders of our country is an incredible moment. So. Yes to AOC, yes to Nancy Pelosi, yes to um, the bipartisan Congress, yes to Chuck Schumer, yes to anyone else that um, wants to invite us and have a real substantive conversation um, and that believe in the same things that we believe in.